More than 12 million Americans suffer with sleep apnea. The disorder can have serious long-term consequences such as heart disease, stroke, and diabetes, but a new treatment could be on the way that's based on a drug that is still illegal in most states. Marty Salt has details. Getting a good night's sleep hasn't been easy for Lisa Smith. Each night is the same. Wide awake, tossing and turning. She was diagnosed with sleep apnea last year after her daughter overheard her trying to sleep. She says, you sound like somebody's in that room, started motorcycles in your room. She said, you snore real loud and sometimes you're not coming back. Doctors prescribed this CPAP machine. Put this to it and just breathe to help her restless nights. The CPAP, although it helps me sleep, I get these marks all over. I gotta wait all day to try to pump my face back up because I got the marks all over my face. But now researchers are studying a new pill that could change that. This would be the first of its kind for sleep apnea. Known as dronabinol, if approved, the synthetic form of cannabis would be taken once at nighttime, says Dr. Ronil Malakani. It is a medication that we think acts on nerve cells in the brain that activate the muscles in the upper airway. Helping keep them open for more restful sleep, just what Lisa longs for. If it will push me, put me to sleep, I would do it. The drug has been used to help cancer patients gain weight and control nausea. Stay with us, we'll be right back.